When beauty reigns and sex sells, what does it mean to be sexy? Is it a look, style, or trend? Or is there more to it? I'm comedian Carrie Riley. You've seen me on the Today Show and Wendy Williams. I'm in search of just what that spark is. And more importantly, how can I get some for myself? Hi guys, it's Carrie. I'm here today at the New York Giants training facility and I'm hanging out with Steve Weatherford, one of NFL's top punters. He has an incredible work ethic and his body is jacked. And when he's not pumping iron, well, he's on the gridiron. Come on, let's go meet him. Wow, you brought the guns today. I did, I did. Just I, I love it, I'm gonna call the NRA. I, think, <laughs> I, I, think, I didn't bring any ammo though. I really thought that uh, he would be like a big muscle guy. That he'd be like, I work out on Mondays. And I was wrong. He is chock full of personality and a sense of humor. Yeah, he smells like muscle and freshness. <laughs> that should be a new deodorant. We should make that. We should. Muscle freshness. Yeah, that's that's what you smell like. Well, now, what's the difference between a punter and a kicker? The kicker kicks it off of the ground and you usually have somebody holding their balls and nobody holds my balls. Nobody holds his balls. Nope. So are you going to show me some punting Anything today? you want. I mean, uh, yeah. You, stop it! <laughs> You naughty boy! He's got all this going on, but then he's got like a little twinkle in his eye going on too. You ready? Yeah, all right. Okay. Wow! It was like watching a master play pool and just put the ball wherever you wanted it. It was unbelievable. Listen, I'm just a regular guy with a rocket launcher for a leg. That's it. That's it. That is it. I don't think this is what they call a rocket launcher. <laughs> I was going to give you more like a pea shooter, but... What's, a, what's a pea shooter? <laughs> it's not a rocket launcher. <laughs> <laughs> He's so goofy, and I love goofy. So you're just kind of throwing it out there kind of like that, and as the ball's in the air, you just want to make contact with it. All right, let's do it. I know that. you can do it. It didn't hit me in the ass, so that was good. Hot! Sorry, team. Oh. I got benched and fired. I'm still safe. <laughs> you're, still, you're very safe. Cut! Wow, that was good. It was? At one point, he said to the cameraman, where do you want it? You want it to the foot of you by the right? Here you go. Boom, and that's where he put it. Woo! What do you see, another good punt. We won! It was like Super Bowl. Then he surprised me with a trip into the New York Giants locker room. What girl doesn't want to go into a professional locker room? Ah, this is nice. This is my locker. Ooh. This is this is where I get dressed and undressed. Where the magic happens. Is there pizza in here? Is there food in here? I don't eat pizza. Really? Ever? Never. No pizza ever? So if I eat pizza, then this picture that my son made for me. Look, oh, look, he so drew cute. me a six pack. Oh, he did. You look like a superhero. Then he springs on me that we're gonna have a shower scene. He brought me in to showers. Oh, ooh, it's really one big shower. But I'm not interested at all. Put this one this way. Put this way. And I got yeah. two coming down on me. Then he took me to his training gym. So we went into this awesome facility, but it's the kind of place where it looks like Rocky would work out, where like you're chasing chickens around and there's tractor tires. This is my off season training venue. I know I'm not gonna be a pro athlete forever, so I'm trying to squeeze every ounce out of my ability that I can now. Yeah, make it the best you can while sure. you have it. Yeah, Cause it's, it's not, not gonna last, last forever. Right, I like that, that's yeah. good, I like that. Looks like he's gonna kill himself at least a hundred times during the workout. He's maxing his body so hard that veins are gonna start busting. Yeah, Terry! Woo! And then he gets done, he's like, oh, that's so great. Come on, Weatherford. Three, four, come on. Five. Ah. Woo! Oh, you have to throw it down. I, oh, oh! Thank you. That's better. Steve can bench press a small Prius. That's the thing with Steve. He's gonna go the extra mile to be a champion. But most people are not gonna go. Nobody expects anything tough out of me, I'm a putter. You can be girly. 
Nobody you're not cares. Gir if... Not girly, but. But hey, waxing is a little girly. Yeah, but I don't wax though. I shave. Oh. I shave my arms though. That's waxing. not so <laughs> right. And what about the chest? You have to shave that too, right? I hate hair. Okay, so everything's shaved. All right, yeah. I, I'm, I understand now. I need everything streamlined. Watching Steve work out was like watching an animal in the wild. Like you could just tell this is first nature to him. To see this guy push himself to the limit was so hot, really. Oh my God, that is heavy. Wow. This is crazy. Here you go. So after the workout, we went back to his apartment to see the rest of his training routine. This is it? This is really simple. Clean. Yeah, no, I But it's like good it. enough, yeah. I take like 18 vitamins in the morning and then 18 at night. So I usually put these in a cup. Twice a day. Twice in the morning I'll take one of these shakes. This is a, this is a vegetable protein that I take in the morning and then at night. Give it a few shakes. All right. And what flavor is it by the way? This is vanilla. Okay. And I take these 18 no, pills. You don't. Stop it. You are gonna choke. So that's what I do. I couldn't take one of these supplements. They were huge pills. Do you have a milk mustache? No. A protein you don't. mustache? You don't. Another thing that I like to kind of supplement into my recovery routine is a hyperbaric oxygen chamber. Really? A hyper haba water? Uh, so we went into his hyperbaric chamber room. When you get inside this, this is pressurized to where it's about 30,000 feet altitude. It's basically a pressurized chamber that's 99% oxygen and it helps with inflammation. I don't know. I thought ibuprofen did the same thing. Is this part of the Michael Jackson collection? <laughs> Can I get in like this? All right. You are going in. Steve, are you okay in there? I'm good. No way in hell I could do this. How long does this thing take? His normal routine is he goes in there for 90 minutes every day. Being this healthy is a full-time job for him. This was like a Houdini trick. Lucky like man. Just looking at this chamber, I started getting sweaty. I started getting claustrophobic. I can barely get on a plane. I will sit yeah, in That's it. all it has is just an attempt. Okay. There we go. It's all coming down on me and it's heavy. And, and all I see is Steve's hands go, it's okay, I'm just gonna zip it up. And I hear, and I went, <laughs> After the hyperbaric chamber, Steve said, you wanna take a look at my Super Bowl trophy? Yes, please. I didn't even know that each teammate gets a Super Bowl trophy. I thought there was just one. They each get a Super Bowl trophy from Tiffany. <gasps> Wow! I, no, am I allowed to touch it? Yeah, Do I need gloves? Do oh. I? Oh my god! Oh my god! Be a Super Bowl champ for a little bit. <sighs> thank you. I'd like to thank um, Super Bowl. That's uh, cool, but this is the ultimate. This is incredible. This is that's the gorgeous. Is this so? This is diamonds. Mm -hmm. It was huge. The ring is huge. He said he doesn't wear it all the time, just for special occasions. So he's not an ostentatious kind of guy either. How do you be a champion? How do you get there? I mean, there's a lot of guys that have been through more than I have, but for me, it's been resiliency, the ability to, to excel in adversity, because I've been cut three times, I've had heart surgery, there's several times I thought that my career was over, so to be where I'm at right now, it's been a lot of fun. That's awesome. What makes Steve so sexy is his body, his muscles popping out of everywhere, but that wouldn't be enough, because we've all seen great bodies before. It's really his playful nature, it's He's present, he's in the moment, and he has this charm where he makes everybody feel like they, in that moment, they are the most important person to him. Thanks for spending the day with me. It was I've so had a great time. Thank it you. It was fun, thank you. And he's funny as all get out. He's so funny. And that's sexy.
Tell me in the comments below who you think is sexy. And don't forget to subscribe for a new episode sent right to you every week. Nappy Tabs heads to Canada, and that means one thing. No, not maple syrup wrestling. Baby London is getting his first passport. Being sexy isn't all about looks. Watch Carrie Riley uncover the sexiest parts of Amanda Russell. Megan's journey's going strong, but she has to step it up to beat this next obstacle. See if she can finish her first 5K here. It takes more than strength to do CrossFit. Learn how to celebrate your success and sisterhood with the women of CrossFit Dynamics. Subscribe for more health tips. Your body will thank you.